Hi, in this video we will see how to register and invoke OCI document understanding service to classify documents and extract key data from document files in Oracle Analytics. First, let us register a document understanding model from the main menu by clicking register model or function and OCI document understanding models. You can either create a new OCI connection or select an existing one. If you are not familiar with creating an OCI connection, please refer to the video link in the description below. Let us select an existing OCI connection. To select a model, you have to select a working compartment from the list of available compartments for the first time. Next time onwards, it is pre-selected. Let us select pre-trained document classification model. It classifies a given input document based on the list of document types such as receipts, invoice, resume, etc. To register this model, we have to select a staging bucket compartment and bucket for securely storing the transit data apart from providing the model name. Below that, you will see the model info and outputs. Now let us select pre-trained document key value extraction. Key value extraction identifies and extracts key data from the input document like merchant name, merchant phone number, merchant address, total price, tax, etc. For this model, we additionally have to select document type which corresponds to the type of document the model is going to use as input. It can be receipt, invoice, passport or driver ID. Let us select receipt. In the bottom pane, you can see the model info and output columns of this model. Let us provide a model name and click register. You can see the registered model under models tab in machine learning page. When you right click and inspect the model, you can see the model's details in the general tab, parameters and output columns in the details tab. Resources tab allows you to modify staging bucket compartment and the bucket name. Let us close this dialog. To invoke the model we just registered, let us create a data flow and select the input data set with a URL of object storage bucket where a list of receipts are stored in the form of images or PDF files. Add a new step and select apply AI model and select the model we registered. You can see a list of output columns. Some of them are checked and some are disabled. We will talk about this shortly. In the parameters, let us select the bucket URL as input column. For the input type, select documents when you have list of document URLs in your input dataset. As we have bucket URL in the input dataset, let us select buckets. Output type has two values, field items and line items. If you select field items, you will see the columns like merchant name, address, phone number, total, etc. from the document in the output and other columns are disabled. When you select line items, you will see details like item name, quantity, price, etc. in the output. Output type parameters is applicable only on receipts and invoice documents. Let us select field items and let us save the data flow and run this data flow. In the background, OCI document service is invoked on the input document files. On successful run, we receive the output from OCI and it is stored as a data set. Let us visualize the output data set in the workbook. You can see merchant name, address, phone number, etc. in the table with and the input receipt documents displayed in the image gallery plugin using document URL obtained from the output. You can filter any particular row from the table to verify the details against the actual input document like the merchant name and address, phone number, total, etc. Thank you for watching this video.